in the previous two lessons we have seen how to define the ratings and values of the equipments and how to model single line diagram now in this lesson we will see uh, another format of this single line diagram and output results you can check this this output as a spreadsheet over here just let's click here so in the excel format it will come so these are the details 37 kilowatt motor 10 kilowatt this db and 1 kilowatt heater and these are the protection protective equipments like this okay now if you click this board single line diagram you can see the single line diagram in this format this first two are transformer feeders this one is for pump motor feeder this one is db and this one is for heater feeder so in this format you can get this output here all the details available here cable length these are the cable length i have specified and here in the second length maximum protected this 248 meter 110 meter 790 meter like this so these are the maximum cable lengths and these are the cable sizes 3 for 35 3 4 for 2.5 so in this format also you can get the single line diagram let's go back to low voltage network single line diagram okay now let's extract the output results those conformity sheets go to printing go to folder models here you can see these are the folder lists folder for controlling organization pretty many study folder studies folder so project folder so under this folder for controlling organization suppose uh, you want to get the reports for the following for these uh, lists and if you want if you want more suppose uh, here it is for board single line maintenance sheet circuit calculation sheet conformity sheet network single line diagram parameters so all these all these items if you don't need you can you can delete it from here how just click here and click delete it will be removed suppose parameter sheet you don't want you can delete folio list you can delete supply sheet you can delete the main thing is that you need only this network single line diagram and conformity sheet so these two sheets generally uh, we need to deliver to the client and others are available documents these all other available documents you can you can get all these outputs also as a report if you want if you want you can anywhere suppose this parameter sheet just click here and click this left arrow see it is now moved over here documents included and if you don't need just click here and delete from this list so only these three reports will be will be printed as per the project output to deliver to the client now how this looks like uh, just to check you can click here under documents tab you see this is the folio list uh, circuits this looks like this uh, suppose network single line diagram it is not the board single line diagram it will come in this format under this board single line diagram 
obtain circuits eight circuits in this format so you can select as per your comment suppose conformity sheet so it will come in this format conformity sheet conformity sheet in this format also you can get in landscape okay so under this folder these three outputs will be there now let's close this one okay now go to page setup we'll see here it will it will ask you which folder under which folder you take you want to take reference suppose this folder for controlling organization let's check this one preview yes now you see this is the both single line diagram each circuit so these two for transformer and these three for other db motor and heater feeder so total five plus one two three so eight circuit so this board signal line diagram you can get it as the output report uh, let's go to next page here this is for db here this is the conformity sheet from this conformity sheet you can see uh, protective uh, device this is for 37 kilowatt motor 50 meter length and here you can see 248 meter maximum protected length is 248 meter okay and this is for uh, this is for 10 kilowatt uh, db feeder 110 meter protect maximum protected length in this case single core 35 square mm and the voltage drop is 8.26 percent 5 percent is maximum allowable limit during running condition and during starting condition 15 percent but or 20 percent uh, or 15 percent or 10 percent um, but the as per the calculation it is 3.42 percent okay let's go to next sheet the uh, this is also network single line diagram if you want to oh, if you want to take it as output you can take otherwise you can deselect from here under this uh, printing folder methods you have to define from here suppose this network single line diagram you don't need so only these two close this one to be set up under this folder and take preview yes both single line diagram and this conformity sheet only okay one more thing uh, just let me let me tell you uh, suppose this one just double click over here suppose this is as per the calculation it is coming single core 35 square mm if we if we select if we select lower side instead of 35 suppose by selecting 6 square mm let's calculate just our section too small error is coming warning let's click ok now, now you see this color is changed because there is a violation so you can check from the colors also whether it is if it is in uh, green then okay then uh, or, or 
if there is any uh, if there is any error or uh, it's not sufficient in that case this color will also changed so let's go back to 35 square mm again let's calculate click ok now you see the color is changed again to its original position so like this you can calculate the low voltage cable sizing calculation with the help of Kaneko BT software.